Hi guys, welcome to day one of our Sims free play advent calendar hints, tips and tutorials. Every day on the one up to Christmas I'm going to be sharing with you a little hint or a tip or a tutorial of how to do certain things in Sims free play. It's kind of like an FAQ of Sims free play. Day one is saving your game to the cloud. This is so, so important. If you've been watching this channel for a while you will know that a while ago, maybe six months ago or so, my phone got stolen and my game wasn't uploaded to the cloud and so the game was only stored on my phone. So I lost my level 55 game. Sims Free Play were wonderful and that gave me another game save, another level 55 game save, but I completely lost my game that I'd been working on for years and years. So these days I always save my main game to the cloud because if you lose your device or if your device gets broken for whatever reason you can always download your game save onto another device. To be able to save to the cloud you first of all need to connect your game to a social channel so either Facebook, Game Center, Google Play Games depending upon whatever device you are playing on and to do that you will need to click on the green button with the three dots. Your layout may be slightly different depending upon the device that you are playing on but click on the green button and this takes you into the settings. The bottom right dark blue is like a, a lock, if you click on that that's your account manager and that is where you sign in and out of various accounts. As you can see I am signed into my social media account so I will be able to save to the cloud and the middle blue button on the right hand side like the little cloud is obviously the cloud so if you go ahead and you click on that. There are two possible options here that you would have. You can have upload save data or download save data. Upload is when you want to put the game that you are playing on on that device up into the cloud. And then obviously download is if you want to bring down a game onto a new device or onto a different device. So I'll just click on the upload save data and it says, are you sure you want to upload it? If you select yes, it will override any previous upload on the server. So you just select yes that you want to upload that save and it says data saved successfully uploaded to the cloud you can now download your progress on a new device it does say data expires in seven days which i'm not entirely sure why it does but apparently it expires in seven days so from here i can go on my ipad or if i get a new device i can download this game save onto that device i just come over to my ipad to show the different setup i know quite a few of you are like oh your layout is different than mine and it's weird I can only show you on iOS, I only have iPads, iPhones, I don't have any Android or any other device to show you that on, but I'm assuming it's pretty similar. But on the iPad here, we've got our settings are in the center rather than over on the right hand side, but it's the same button that you press, it's the green semicircle this time in the middle with the three dots that takes you into the settings. And then you just come up to the same screen where you can go ahead and click on the cloud and you can download the game save. We have the options to upload save data or download save data. And as you can see, it says uploaded six minutes ago from Sarah's iPhone via iOS. So the game I have just uploaded to the cloud, I can now bring down onto my iPad if I want to. Obviously that will delete this game save that I have on my iPad, which I don't wanna do, so I'm not gonna do it. But I can also upload this game to the cloud if I wanted to. But I'm happy with having my iPhone game up on the cloud. This is kind of just my secondary game, which I'm not that concerned about. So there you go, that is how you save your game to the cloud. I know quite a lot of people have lost their game in the past when I made my video about me losing my phone and therefore my game save. Loads of people were in the comments saying, oh my goodness, I feel so sorry for you, that's happened to me. Everyone who plays Sims Replay seems to at some point or another have lost their game save. So definitely make sure you connect to social accounts if you have them. Obviously if you don't have social accounts, even if it's the Game Center or the Google Play account, you won't be able to connect. I know quite a few people maybe don't like to have Facebook accounts, but I would definitely recommend getting one of them so that you can upload and save your game. Thank you so much for watching day one of our Sims Free Play Advent Calendar hints, tips and tutorials. Tune in tomorrow where I will be sharing another helpful hint for Sims Free Play. I will see you guys then. Bye!